Hi, James Crockett, Strategic Product Manager for Elgin Sweeper Company. Today, we're gonna to talk about the Crosswind with Shared Power, which is also the same product that we have running on the NASCAR circuit, again in 2016, starting here with the Sprint Unlimited at the Daytona, and then going from the 500 and throughout the remainder of the season. Again, shared power on the Crosswind is utilized on the NASCAR circuit because not only does it reduce the fuel economy, or increase the fuel efficiency by 16%, uh, reducing the uh, CO2 footprint by 12 tons a year per unit, but it's also tested by NASCAR to dry tracks 80% faster, reducing 80% um, CO2 emissions by also consuming 80% less fuel as a, as a program, as a system. So using the technology that we have as standard on the Crosswind was very um, instrumental as becoming a partner for NASCAR Green. So taking the technology that we use on the racetracks and applying it back into the municipal or customer applications, Crosswind with shared power is offered on conventional or cab over chassis. You have the Freightliner, uh, International, uh, the auto car is shown here, as well as the Peterbilt. How many, uh, how big is this sweeper? This sweeper is an eight cubic yard volumetric capacity. Um, in terms of how shared power works, it is still the same as last time you and I had spoken. Uh, we're still taking horsepower off of the Allison transmission, converting that from mechanical power to um, hydraulic fluid power. That hydraulic fluid power goes into the sweeper system, as seen above. And again, we're able to apply that hydraulic fluid power back into the fan over here, which is kind of probably tough for you to see, but that is a, able to allow us to use All right, there we go. We apply it back down in there. Okay. Sorry for the poor So that's, uh, yeah, and that's, uh, that's what operates the fan right. and provides power for the sweeping. But in doing so, what it allows us to do is to still utilize the reliable and the durable and proven John Deere 4045T auxiliary engine, but we use a 74 horsepower auxiliary engine now. And what that allows us to do is to get away from the more stringent um, space consuming componentry that the higher horsepower tier four final engines require. So here, what we have here for emission compliance for tier four final is only a DPF right here, a downstream DPF, but also a DOC. That's all that's required. Uh, it, it'll do an active or passive regeneration, which is really no different than any other OEM on highway chassis does today and has done for the last few years. We do not require DEF to do a regeneration with this aux engine. So again, you've got the hydraulic fluid power coming off the chassis, applied back into the fan, combined with 74, gives us that customer expected sweep performance that a regener regenerative air sweeper has come to have been expected in applications such as general municipal sweeping, um, picking up of light sand, gravel, some rock, and then some trash and other organics. All right, and, uh, and the crossword for those people who, uh, you know, have been living under a rock uh, is a what kind of sweeper? It's a regenerative air sweeper, thus a closed loop air stream. So basically the fan draws a vacuum here in this hopper. That vacuum picks up debris on the suction side here, which is conveniently located on the curb side of the sweeper. While at the same time, you got the blast energy being generated by the fan, which is diverted down on the other side of the, uh, of the pickup head. That blast energy is applied through the blast orifice and moves that debris from left to right, but also 
picking it up into the airstream so that when it makes a turn on the suction inlet, it goes immediately up into the hopper and, and settles out. Okay. Is, uh, and uh, talk a little bit, if you would, James, about what Eco Infused uh, means. You've, you've had that branding now. Yeah, for we've a had the years. branding now for uh, three years. Mm -hmm. And it, it's the same message that we use on um, with the NASCAR Green platform. It's our, our badge to show that a product is environmentally friendly, it's got an environmentally friendly uh, inherent attributes and features, such as, again, as I mentioned, the crosswind. Um, can benefit a particular user by uh, improving fuel efficiencies by 16%. Uh, again, offsetting your CO2 footprint by 12 tons a year, which is pretty significant if you add it up across the amount of units that we've sold over the last few years that are now out in the field. So again, environmentally friendly. That's our badge that's on every crosswind. Um, and soon to be on other air products such right. as the Whirlwind, which will also carry the same shared power technology. All right. Is there anything else you want us to tell us about this sweeper? Or, uh, should they, or at least you can tell me where they should send a check or purchase well, order. Well, again, we've got the largest dealer network throughout the North America. Um, you know, 35 locations, 35 dealers with 100 locations throughout the United States and in Canada. Um, Again, Elgin Sweeper, if you want to learn more information, please go to our public website at elginsweeper.com. You can look at us on Facebook as well as on Twitter. All right. Thanks a lot. Thanks. Thank you. As always, nice job. Thanks.